hi guys welcome back to my channel again first of all how are you guys how are you doing what's up what's popping i'm going to review two different foundations so i'm gonna start off with the black opal then go off to the revlon my to go my to go my to go foundation is always black opal i always use black opal whether it's stick whether it's the liquid whether it's the the powder for perfecting all those all those today i was in town because i knew i didn't have a foundation i don't even know where this came from in the house first of all so this is black opal true color for perfecting liquid foundation in beautiful bronze it helps minimize appearance of pores matte finish light medium coverage so i always use this what i love about it is that matte finish and earlier i used to use mac yeah mac foundation and to find out that mac i couldn't get my actual actual color i either get a dark one or you get a light one then i got to find this black opal if it's dark i don't know i know how to go about it it's gonna be like my color so we go to Revlon. Revlon. Okay, Revlon. Now here's the story. I've never thought about using Revlon. Never, 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 never in my life. Um, today when I was in town, as I told you guys, I didn't know there was this in the house. So when I was in town today, um, I was going to get the black opal. So I went round, round. I couldn't get in beautiful bronze. There were other types, but not beautiful bronze. You guys don't mind my face. I've just done. I've just done my eyes, and the concealer has come all this way. So if he looks lighter and he looks dark, yo, yo, I've not finished my makeup. I'm not done. As I was saying, I went to Ken's pharmacy because I think those people sell legit makeup. Yeah. If I can't find to places that I'm used to, I go to Ken's pharmacy. So I went to Ken's pharmacy. There's also not in beautiful bronze. Uh, Maybelline it wasn't full coverage and I need full coverage because of the dark spots and everything the lady who was selling to me was like you can try Revlon because it's full coverage and everything so I was like okay let's try it here's the Revlon at the cup it's written 24 hours well combination or only and it's called Revlon color stay has an SPF or 15 broad spectrum my color is for 10 cappuccino if it's darker I don't know we're gonna find out I just we tested and that's what was suited for me so it gets darker oops I have my to go so let's see let's see my skin is very sensitive oh sensitive you know the meaning of sensitive just a little heat or little changes in in the makeup not even the makeup makeup is fine little changes in oils i use it's gonna cause kills 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 no let's start with the new one yeah let's start with the new one so when it lets me down i have my to go this is the Revlon foundation hmm cappuccino color for 10 cappuccino without the highlighting without the everything you know I don't want to highlight because I am going to use uh, the black opal one so to be too much for nothing from what I see it's not that bad it's not that bad it's not that bad I think this is my color it, okay when I don't have my makeup on I have a lot of rashes a lot Oof. I don't, but I don't know where those rashes came from, but they're really stressing me crazy. So as I was saying, it's kind of brushed them off. As in here, they're not even brushed. It's like concealed them in a way because I barely see the rashes right now. They're not that much, but I can still see them, but they're not as visible as they are when they don't have any makeup on. Oh, I remember, you know, a, on the weekend, we had gone to, to some getaway and during the getaway they brought a makeup artist and the makeup artist did maybelline on me and that maybelline really 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 showed off the pose and that's why today when when i was going to buy the foundation then the lady was like you can have maybelline i was like is it full coverage total not even full yeah full or total coverage she was like no it's not it was like hey yo i don't want jokes i want total coverage so she recommended the revlon of which it's not that bad oh jesus christ as i was saying so that you know it's like it's like uh 
it's like really concealing or yeah concealing the pores or something of the sort um i forgot to use my my primer mm, i forgot to use my primer for the primer i use this it's too bright oh my god i use elf mineral infused face primer my face looks so flawless um see this helps your skin as in closes the the, the pores in a way so that your makeup can look flawless so i did the foundation without applying this and it still looks this so i can say it's not that bad it's it's legit it's good it's nice it's awesome i'm gonna go to my favorite which is black opal let's see the difference i will still root to the the, the the primer we're still gonna just do it you go to kimala mala back to my foundationless face this is the black opal true color for perfecting liquid foundation um helps minimize the appearance of pores matte finish light medium coverage okay like this one looks kind of lighter than the other one it's lighter yeah it looks kind of lighter and it's lighter and definitely it's not okay it's not my color but let's see this one even applying it is hard it's not as smooth as the other one so as it, as you apply it it's like in a kauka before madlize kupaka i think that's what makes it look matte so you have to really do it fast before it dries up it's gonna be hard really hard to do it you really feel the the matte finish because it's so this one the black opal goes for 250 if you buy it from linton's and i couldn't get it at linton's at that time so get it at linton's they sell at 250 then i bought this one from can pharmacy Bihi towers um we're gonna get it at 1800 beauty at a budget i guess i'm done so that's my verdict on the foundation to use and my favorite as i said is the black opal foundation um next off i'm gonna show you guys if i prefer stick foundation or i prefer the, the liquid foundation i um, it's not like I wouldn't prefer um, Revlon. It's just that if I don't have any other option, Revlon is going to be my number two. To be honest, I've never seen another better foundation apart from La Copal. Eh, compared this foundation is really matte. kind of work, really work blending things. By the way, I barely set my face. Kitabo, Kitabo, I used to be so committed to doing everything to my face. I don't know what happened by the way these days. I just do so little, but still turns out okay. And now that I was doing this video, I decided why not? I didn't know setting your face is gonna make such a big change. Oh guys, oh I know I know you guys love my eyes. I know you wanna ask um where they buy my lenses. Um how much are they? What color is that? It's okay, I'm gonna tell you guys. So, um these lenses I bought them from Iman Beauty. Oh, they're in shade khaki. Yes. I bought them at Iman Salah's shop Bihi Towers, ninth floor. They are two thousand. They are variety, variety. So if you won't cost out the one that you want. I'm gonna apply a little blush. No, I love to smile. I love my smile. Ooh. Okay, that's a fake one. I know it's beautiful. We got with the highlight. The highlight. Hey, by the way, I did not come to play with you guys. Blind them. Blind them all. Now let's go to the lipstick. My makeup is done, and this is the lipstick that I got. It's called Pudea. The color is to die for. It's really chipping. I am done with my video. If there's any review you guys want me to do about makeup, leave it in the comment section. And if you've not watched my previous video, just go back and watch it trust me it's gonna help you if you want to be helped or if you just want to watch for the fun just go do your thing and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you've not subscribed please subscribe don't forget to subscribe i need the family to grow bye bye guys
Thank you.